I'm a bit shocked with what happened last night. Instead of voting off the person that I wanted to vote off, instead we kept her in the game and voted off someone that we knew was going to get out soon by Dallas. And I can't believe he told us that the rules were changing and that it's now a contestant vote. I, I under estimated Tiana completely. You do need allies in this game, especially since the new rules, how it's a contestant vote. I'm so doomed. Now that my dad does not even want to work with me, Tiana despises me, Maxi despises me, all I have is Dexter, and he probably heard the whole conversation, even though he didn't really talk yesterday, and I have no idea why. I think he's just thinking about a few things, and I completely understand that. Yeah. I think I should start picking up the pieces and picking up the pace with my gameplay. If I'm going to win this competition, I cannot be an underdog. I am going to try tonight to be the most popular contestant out of all of them. And I'm dang going to try hard with my dishes. And I'm just going to use so many ingredients. And it's such a relief that Slush, Kiki, and George are gone. They were my main three that I really wanted to go out. Well, except Slush a bit. I kind of was going to make an alliance with him, but then it all turned down because I have never told Roger that I was part of wanting to put glue in his brownies. And how it didn't work just really upsets me. And I'll slush my ally member w went home instead of um, George. And George has mistaken his dishes the first two times. And he spilled his slushy last night. So that's what he got. He got the boot, but I just don't understand. He never had that voice in the first place, and he thought, oh, since I use this voice, it's not going to be offensive when I insult people for literally no reason. That makes no sense. I am actually more happy that George is gone instead of being happy that Kiki is gone. Hey, Dexter. Oh, hey, Mark. Um... I want to say, since the new rules in the competition, I think we should form an alliance. What makes you say that? I heard everything you wanted to talk about about Tiana's vote off. Pfft, you think I'll make an alliance with you? All I know is that you're just going to blindside the kind peers. We are the only kind people left in the game. Kiki was a brat, Slush was a brat, and George was a brat. They're all gone, and they were all the first three people out of the competition. It's now up to whoever Dallas thinks has the worst dish and building friendship. I think we should try to build a friendship. You didn't even get Tiana a chance with building a friendship with her, and you still decide to just try to vote her off for, like, no reason. That was for my behalf of the gameplay. It was not literally my fault. It was my decision. I really wanted her gone because she seems like such a big threat in this game. And I'm not going to listen to you ranting about me with the whole Tiana situation. I am done with that type. I am done with her. She is, like, I need to get her out as soon as possible. And then I have to blindside my dad. You're going to blindside your own dad? Wow, you're such a meanie. I'm not even going to talk to you. Leave me alone. I don't know what my son was thinking about last night about trying to get out my biggest ally member. That would ruin my whole entire game if the rules changed and Tiana got out of the competition. And she's such a nice person. I've only had to tell her once that violence is not the way. And now she's been super nice to literally everyone. And Mark just doesn't like her because he doesn't think that Tiana will split the money with him. With me. And I was going to split the money with him of the split money that Tiana gave us. If either of us won the show. It's like, I don't know if he's right about Tiana or not, but I don't think he is. I'm super upset with him, and now I don't even really want to work with him anymore. Upsetting. I never wanted the drama to be against me, but of course it has to happen. Every single time drama happens in this game, it's all because of me. It's Mark that really wanted me to get voted out, and I completely understand that. I seem like I am a very big threat in this game but i never wanted to put that against him i literally don't understand why he wants to be a complete brat towards me but if he wants to get me out i'm totally fine with it i'm extremely happy i voted off george last night he was blackmailing me so i didn't know about his real voice and i thought that was super stupid of him 
But now he's finally gone, and I can finally do the game I want to play. I'm not necessarily going to play solo, but I'm going to try to get in the alliance of Roger, Tiana, Roger, and Tiana. So, yeah. And maybe I can pull it off. I may have seen a really insane at first, but that's because I wanted to play as a character. But then I noticed, since George tried to play as a character... He doesn't make it far, and Dallas really hated him. So that's why I think I should stop playing the character and just play as myself. Bakers, please make your way into the kitchen. So, I really just want to check in with you guys. How do you guys feel about the new rules? Mark, I'll start with you. Well, this has really ruined my gameplay. I didn't know we needed allies in this game, and now I completely lost trust in one and, like, two of the people still in this competition. I don't know who to go after, and I do not know what I'm supposed to do in this game anymore. Tiana, what do you think about the new rules? I know exactly what I want to do next in the game for my gameplay to see if I can win. I'm thinking about splitting the money with Roger because he's part of my alliance. Dexter. I really feel like an underdog, and I think I should really pick up the pieces in my game and try to not become an underdog anymore. Instead, I'm trying to stand out a little bit more and have a little bit more lines in each episode of the game. Maxi. I'm just trying to make alliances so I can keep myself still in the game. I am super proud that George is gone, though. He literally blackmailed me. I was actually the first one to know about his real voice, but I he pretended I didn't, so you guys wouldn't see me as a backstabber. But now that you, you guys know his real voice, hopefully you guys will me let me fit in and ha make me have an alliance. I'm sorry that I didn't tell you guys. Roger. I think it's completely fine, Maxie. George should not have blackmailed you, and I don't even think he deserved to go past episode two. And, uh, yes, as Tiana said, I'm in an alliance with her, and I'm thinking about doing that so I can get farther into my game and maybe end up winning. Now, you might see some weird faces. These are our guest judges. They will also be voting with us at tonight's Baker Ceremony. Introducing Cody. Hello. Sarah. Hi. And Spencer. Hello. You said I could be in it too. Butch, I never said that. But I think the Spencer team. Yeah, he literally follows me around all day long. Um, security, we need to get Butch out of the room. But wait, no, 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 no. Don't bring me out. Don't bring me out. Now that that's out of the way, there is no category for this episode, but I want you guys to step up your dish after last episode. If I would rate it out of 10, Mark will have the highest score with only a 5. That's only half the score. With the rest of you guys, um, you either be 4 or below. And tonight, there will be three people up for voting instead of two, but the rest of the episodes there will be only two until we reach the final four. At the final four, we'll be back to me choosing someone to automatically go home, and then we'll have the finale. So, without further ado, one, two, three, bake. I don't feel like cooking tonight, so I guess the only thing I would like to do is bake an egg or something. So, I'm gonna do that. I've heard crazy stories come from this blender, but whatever. Boy, you forgot to crack the egg. Oh, oh no, oh, oh. Ow, ow, hot. Ugh. Oh, now I just broke it all over the floor. Boy, you're stupid. I'm just gonna pretend I didn't hear that. Boy, I prefer shut up. Boy. A little bit more butter. 
nothing's better than baked potatoes. I'm already done. Wow, that's like the shortest time you've ever taken, Dexter. Yep. Wow, that cooked tomato is beautiful. You're just serving us a plain old potato that doesn't even look cooked. Shut up, oi. Did you just copy of my line? Yep, boy. Boy, I'll hit you with a spatula. No! Ugh! Ow! So, Dallas, you're just going to let them abuse me? Pretty much. Wow. Vegetables. Yummy! So I can see all of you guys are done? Yeah? What did it look like to you? What does it look like? Daz, I think you're going insane. Well, if you think I'm insane, let's try your insane dish, Roger. Gladly. Oops, I didn't save some for any of you guys. I don't even want to judge here. Okay, whatever. You guys can just do the vote when I put the people up for elimination. Okay, so Roger and I are not up for elimination. Yeah. Yes. That's true. Um, Baked potatoes are the best. Dexter, you're not up for elimination. Boy, that just leaves us. You never tried our dishes. Oh, well, let's try their dishes, and then I'll make my final decision. Mark, ring up your egg. Mark. How oh, can you not learn anything from episode two? Like, what do you mean? That was undercooked like your pie in episode two. Oh, okay, sorry. Maxie, let's try your dish. And also, Mark, you're up for elimination. Oh, crap. Same with Mark. It's undercooked. You are also up for elimination. It's now either going to be Tiana or Dexter or Roger being up for elimination, too. Tiana, bring up your dish. Um, I never forgot. I forgot to pour it, so you're just going to have to eat it out of the blender. Okay. Well, that was actually pretty good, so I'm going to switch your spot. I'm going to switch the elimination spot with Dexter. Like, you're safe, Tiana. Okay. Um, then when I already said, Dexter, you're up for elimination. What? But I thought you said my dish was the best. Okay, you're up for elimination. And that's because Dexter, I'm going vegan, and it actually tasted really good. And, um... You are not going vegan. Not on my watch. Do not start a fight with me. You're up for elimination. Well, crap. I'll give us all some time to decide. Everyone go head back. Well, it's literally just us safe. Yeah. Except for the judges in Dallas. But, um, I think we should decide now. Um, the two I have in mind are Dexter and Mark. Why Dexter, though? And why not Maxie? Well, Maxie, she told me that she was trying to play a character when she was insane in the first two episodes. But now she's trying to play as herself now. And I actually can see her real characters. And I really like it. So I think we should keep her into the final three. And I can, and then if you win if, or if I win, I can split the money with the two of you. Okay, that sounds good. But why do you... Just tell me a reason why you want to vote out Dexter. I want to vote out Dexter because, um, he was part of the plan to put glue in your brownies. Oh my gosh, I knew he was part of that. Okay, yeah, let's vote off Dexter tonight. And Mark is your son, but he was really rude to me. But let's just vote off Dexter, okay? Well, we don't have enough power, and we can't make an alliance with any of the judges. So let's just hope it works, okay? So, Sarah, what are you thinking? I'm just paranoid of this competition. Everyone here seems really insane. Like you. What did you say? Your obsessed for pink is super annoying. Whatever. Um, well, I was thinking that Maxi Cat. She started a fight. I thought that Dexter or Mark dude, I don't even know which one of them, he also started a fight with us. Yeah, I'm voting on whoever started the fight with me. Boy! 
then you either have to vote off like Dexter or Maxi. I think it was Dexter. Let's rewind the quips. No, let's not do that. Okay. Um. What about that Mark dude? Uh, he seems completely innocent. Yeah, I've made my decision. What is it? I'm not telling you. It has to be a surprise for some sort of this episode. Sure. pretty explainable but I think you guys know yes we're all gonna go up in a voting booth and we're gonna vote one of you three off whoever gets the most votes will be leading in the competition tonight well let's get to the vote Tiana you're up you tried your little tricks on my friend and it's not gonna work tonight you're going home we're not that good at covering up things so i guess it just doesn't work tonight but i just have to go with my alliance i'm gonna send you home tonight i'm sorry you seem like you won't be a big threat in the competition in the future so i see you as an underdog and i don't like underdogs so i'm gonna uh, vote you off tonight sorry Y'all character is so bland and sounds so rare. You seem like you're the person who wants to go against someone. I am voting you off tonight, you stupid. You tried to start a fight with me in the kitchen. Unacceptable, boy. I'm voting you off tonight. As me being a girl's donation, I don't like that talk. go tally and read the votes. First vote. Dexter. Maxi. Mark. That's one vote all. Dexter. That's two votes Dexter. Mark. That's two votes, Mark. Two votes, Dexter. One vote left. Fourth person going home of the stuffed animal bake off. Dexter. <sighs> well, good game. Good game, everyone. Good luck, you four. I'm rooting for you. Oh my gosh, Dexter, that must have been so painful. Are you okay? <sighs> Don't think I know. I know what you guys did. I know what you guys did. Well, I really wanted that Mark guy to go. You imbecile! Well, I'll go before anything crazy happens. It was nice meeting you, Mark. Okay, it was nice meeting you, Maxie. Thank you. It was nice meeting you, Roger. Nice meeting you, Tiana. And especially you, it was nice meeting you, Dallas. Good game, Dexter. Good game. Well, I'll be heading out now. Everyone say goodbye to the guest judges. Bye. Bye. It was nice meeting y'all. In the zoo. I'm going to slap you again. No, you're not. Hope you'll lose. Well, you guys have made it almost as far as you can in the game. The next person who is getting voted off will be the final person voted off before the finale. Congratulations, Roger, Mark, Maxi, and Tiana. You guys are our final four. Have a good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. We are so close to the finale. What will happen next to the contestants? Find out next time on the next episode of the Bake Off.